All right, Thursday the 22nd up here on Harvard. And uh, not a cloud in the sky, but you would have never known after last night's uh, storm. Suddenly it just formed and brewed right up over me. I talked to Chris on the phone. He looked at the radar, and it was one of those events where the mountain creates its own weather. And uh, so it was pretty incredible. There was charges up here, zappings. And in fact, my tent itself got struck by lightning after I got off the summit. The poles must have got so hot that they put a hole in my tent in a couple of different spots. You can see right here where it got struck. A piece of the pole got busted. I'll be able to examine that and look at it a little bit later. But you can actually see a piece of the pole there. And it smells like, smells like fire, smells like charges and lightning clearly struck that. So that's pretty incredible. Basically what happened was I opened up my tent flap, lightning struck about, with about a two second delay right over the peak. And then I looked out, I didn't have a headlamp, which I found out later, and so I clearly feel like it's a miracle. There was an angel sitting right on this rock right here pointing down to go down. Their only way to get off of this is to go down right through there. I went down. This whole area of rocks was lit up and illuminated by the charges. Once I got down into that saddle and was walking, lightning struck right up here. Almost instantaneously, I felt heat on the left side of my body. And uh, I didn't get hit though. It was very close. And then I bailed off down into the valley and got into that basin. But by 10.30, everything died off. So this happened right about 9.40, 9.30 to 9.40. Came back up here, and of course the tent was still there. And then I didn't see these holes until the morning. There's a hole on the top, there's a hole inside the tent. So this area clearly got struck by lightning last night. It was a freak storm. And I'll get another explanation probably with Chris. I'll shoot some video. But uh, it was pretty intense. Crazy night. Four peaks remaining. Somehow, some way, I'm still finding a way. And I know for that, that one for a fact, that God was watching over me and made sure I got out of here in the nick of time. So uh, that's it from Sunrise up here on Mount Harvard, and I'll have this online for you to check it out. Thanks for tuning in.